following contest is the Women's War Games match! The rules of the match are as follows. Two teams will be contained in separate cages, with one member of each team starting the match. At regular intervals, alternating members from each team will be released to enter the match. The first member to enter will come from the advantage team. Once all competitors have entered, War Games officially begins! The match can be won by pinfall or submission. Exiting the cage will result in a forfeit. Now, let the War Games begin! One of the all-time greats in the women's division, the Empress of Tomorrow. Introducing first, from Osaka, Japan, Asuka! We know this superstar is always ready for anything, but no one is ever truly ready for war games. Oh, she knew what she was getting into here. What it meant to lead her team into this cage. But did she know they'd be outnumbered for most of the match? Her team is at a real handicap here and can expect to endure a ton of punishment. I think she has the mental and physical strength to overcome that challenge to guide her team to victory. Well, I think it's safe to say there is nothing but trouble on the way. And representing damage control from San Jose, California, Bailey! Bailey is ringing the doorbell, about to enter war games. Ding dong, hello! Yeah, Bailey led her teammates in damage control in their War Games battle against Team Bianca at Survivor Series War Games. But Bailey lost that night and is looking to redeem herself tonight. The old Bailey would be overwhelmed by War Games, unwilling to do what it takes to succeed in this structure. This structure is not meant for hugs. But the Bailey we see now has already shown she can survive War Games. Now she's looking to prove she can win. The War Games match, definitely not for the squeamish. Two teams of superstars with license to truly do whatever they want to each other. As a fairly squeamish guy myself, this match always makes me uncomfortable, but it's a huge opportunity to make a moment or cement yourself as a star to watch. I hope someone here does that, and I hope nobody gets too hurt. They are doing whatever they please. That showed a complete lack of respect for your competition and for our sport. Uh-oh, forearm gonna cut off the win. Guillotine. The guillotine locked in. This is all, no, it was an incredible counter. Ah, uh, takedown, and now punches right. Good night. You could see that each strike drained their opponent's energy. the exploder. I don't think people realize the amount of strength it takes to hurt someone like that. Counter! And now there's an opening. Look at this. Only seconds away from giving their team the numbers advantage. 
are on the loose, looking to change the landscape of this match. Oh, leg lariat. Tough position to be caught in here. Check your face out of that one. Enters the ring and is diving head first into the chaos of this match. Arm trapped. One after the other. You can't get caught in a hailstorm like that if you want to win. You can see these competitors looking a little more settled in now. You think the nerves have worn off? To a degree, sure. But the thing about war games is that the landscape can change in an instant. Nobody can get too comfortable or it might turn to a disadvantage their team needs to overcome collectively. From the middle rope. Oh, what a splash! The target was acquired, and the warhead did not miss. <laughs> Boom on the jaw. Here comes the buzzer. The numbers advantage vanishes with this next entrant. Sending her over to the other ring, utilizing the unique surroundings. Like a bat out of hell and about to even things up in war games. Uh. DDT planet. Uh. Tossed into the corner. Oh, target in the arm. This has got to hurt. Pulverized in the arm is a great way to create an advantage. Basically forcing your opponent to fight one-handed. Establishing dominance. <laughs> she just caught a rough landing into dangerous territory. <laughs> oh! Bianca wants to put EA behind her right now. The EST powering up. Trying to free herself from the triangle. Left hands fighting desperately, and she's free. Blackjack! Entering the ring and assessing the situation. Dominating shoulder tackle. The competent Belair not backing down here. Ascending the War Games cage, no idea what her plan can be. Oh, kick right to the back of the leg. Here we go. Oh, oh, by Bailey. Oscar won't come back after that. Ooh, she counters right back on Bailey. Ben Tell, what a slam! And here we go, climbing up the cage. Only bad things happen from that decision. Bullseye with the drop kick. Side headlock applied. Oh, and a right hand for good measure. The next entry incoming to even up the odds. Whatever's playing here can't be good. And attacking the both the shoulders has become the strategy here. Charging toward the ring and looking to even things up. Big time spike. Officially begun as the last combatant in assesses the situation. Entering one of the most dangerous matches in WWE history has to be unnerving. Two on one face 
backbreaker. Elbow drop. Oscar could be moments away from her end. Wow, that won't separate your shoulder. That'll divorce it. Liv's fully intent on ending things here. Now we have Liv Morgan. Jumping complete shot. Can Liv put things away here? She scores big with the counter. And look at front. to capitalize after the reversal. Reigns down an elbow to retaliation. Eo looking for a submission, face first. Eo Sky's got it locked in, the Koji clutch. Oh, Bianca Belair, I think she's gonna tap out. This is not gonna be... Perhaps thinking something else here. Not sure why though, Michael. She seemed to have it really cinched in. It's hooked up, lays the grid behind off the... Wait, 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 wait. Are you kidding me? How did she break the Oscar lock? A rough landing as she was launched like a missile into the other ring. She covers for the pin. Oh, I thought it was over, but again. Can we please get some control? Face first with a waist lock takedown. And that was an efficient form of offense with that move. Great amount of force sends her all the way to the other ring. victorious team gotta give this team credit few matches put you to the test like war games does so to win this really speaks to their abilities 